All right, this is Thunder with uh, Grayland.com. We got another uh, Grayland challenge today. Uh, this time it's out in the great state of Colorado, where we have uh, Manny. Manny, are you there? Yes, I am. How are you awesome. Doing, All right, you, uh, you, uh, curiosity got to the best of you. You looked on YouTube and said, what is this all about? I got to see it for myself. So um, we're going to do a Grayland challenge here. Fire up your car. Yes, sir. And uh, tell us what the RPMs are sitting at. Uh, RPMs are just a little, just a hair above uh, 100 RPM. Okay. Uh, 1, and, I'm sorry, 1,000 RPM. Right. You got about 1,000 RPM, 1,050, yeah. we'll call it. All right. Okay. And uh, if you would, run to the back real quick and just smell the exhaust system. Okay. You put your hand down there as well. Feel it. Okay. Uh, since you got glasses there, it's always good to uh, do that as well. We'll put your glasses down, and we will um, hold that next to the exhaust system. Okay. And you, you and you'll see down? that um, you know there's really no uh, condensation or steam that occurs on pollution will not fog glass. So the pollution will not fog the glass. Yeah. No. So it leaves kind of you know just yeah. All right. And now how's the smell? Okay, I can smell it. Yeah. All righty. All right, I'm going to deploy the text. Stand by. I'll be right back. And as soon as that image comes in, yes, sir. Uh, I'll give you next instruction. Stand by. Okay. You have to go there to use email. Oh, I'm trying to figure out how my can do it. You got that? Where do you get it up at? Oh, way back here. So you have to do it. Oh, that's the damn thing is way up there. The exhaust of the vehicle. Okay. I am sweet, though. What, what, now, what do you mean? You can in this uh, see how to go. Oh. This is supposed to send it on this on the top one, or is it sending it to your to your email? I don't know. All right, well, I, hopefully you get to Because I don't have an email. Oh, I mean, texting me to you. Oh, yeah. So you have to get it. I don't want to send it. Because that's when you have to do this. Yeah, well, that's the. That's the one that I do. Well, that's the one that I do. That's the one that I do. That's the one that I do. So he, whatever he says, should be over on this side. So he can pick it. Okay. So he can send a picture. So we'll have to either go back to it. Oh. To, the, to, the, to him? Yeah. Right there. See what he was trying to tell you, Joanna? Look, when you hold your glasses up to it, see it? It's fogging it. All right, sorry about that, Manny. Yes, sir, no problem. Had a little, that uh, must be some uh, bad weather out there. We had two uh, channels, like uh, two networks that the cell towers weren't connecting to your signal. And so I'm, what I'm doing is we're attaching the uh, frequency of our technology onto your phone. So uh, although the weather looks nice in your area, we had a, um, 
partly cloudy. It's actually starting to look like it's breaking up. It did. We did have a cloud cloud cover pretty much earlier. Huh. As we can tell, it's starting to break up. Well, see if that uh, comes through, and let me know when that image comes in. Okay, so so you're sending it to the, her text, right? Her yeah. Text? Okay. So bring it back up here. Well, there it is. Okay, we found it. Okay. And now what do we do with it? Okay, so you're looking at that picture? Oops, hang on a minute. Yeah. Okay, now take the phone and, and that picture, making sure that the, you know, if you got to tap the uh, picture every so often to keep the light on. But let's aim that toward the car for the next two minutes. Okay. So I just got to keep tapping it too. Okay, I got you. Is that about right Right about in that area? Well, you can't tell where I'm holding it. You said right about the front of the tire, uh, by the gas tank, uh, the, where you, where you uh, put in the fuel, the fuel, right? Right. So, like, if, if the phone is now, that picture is just pointing right toward where the gas tank is. Yes, sir. Okay. All right, let me start my clock. We'll have this going for uh, two minutes. And you'll still be able to bring it back up? Yeah? If, yeah. It, if it fades out? Oh, yeah. Okay. So, in other words, you're just waking it up. Yeah. Well, okay. yeah. Well, we're going to do two cars today? Yes, sir. Okay. A, uh, the next vehicle is a Chevrolet G71. Oh, no. It's a Chevy. Chevy Avalanche. It's a Chevy Avalanche. 05. 05 model. All right, go ahead and uh, fire that one up, too. Okay. I'm going to go ahead and do that. And get the uh, baseline RPMs there. Okay. okay, that's that's good on the first car. Now let's bring uh, back up to the um, ring central screen. Okay. Bring it back to the screen. Okay. There we go. Okay. Here we go. All right, now uh, let's rev up the uh, Nissan here for another minute or two at about 2,500 RPMs while she's running off to start up the um, the uh, Avalanche, correct? That's, that's correct. Can you see okay. the RPM on the... Uh, no, it's, yeah, it's, that's okay. There we go. That's good. Just, yeah, hold there for about a minute. Okay. And... Uh, She's starting up the avalanche, and then what we'll have you do is um, go smell that exhaust, and okay. and then uh, uh, check the RPMs, and then we will uh, duplicate the same thing. Pull the image up and start pointing it toward the uh, avalanche. Okay. Did you need to know the amount of mileage from the? No. The, the, it's not important, but uh, how many miles are on this car? Seventy nine. I'll just go over seventy nine thousand. Okay. Yeah. You what you're gonna want to do is you want to run a couple of tanks of gas, you know, all the way through. Uh, figure about you know four or five hundred miles, and uh, then you want to change the oil out on the first round. Yeah, absolutely. It's uh, it's gonna knock out eighty thousand miles worth of crud that's inside that engine. Okay. Okay, give it a couple good punches. Okay, that RPM settled down a little bit. Yes, it did. This went down below, uh, so it's maybe at, uh, oh, maybe 75,000 RPM. Yeah. 750, yeah. All right, that one's working. All right, let's go take a whiff of that one. 
Okay, we'll do. And this is your, this is where the curiosity meets the road. <laughs> Give me a second here. Wow, that's a big difference. Right on. All right, let's go do that avalanche now. Okay, you want to go to the avalanche next? Yep. Okay. That's a difference, man. Right here? Yeah. Okay, where are we going? Joanna, Joanna. Joanna. <laughs> what are you doing? Okay, yeah, hang on. All right, you there? Yeah, we're here. Oh, okay. What am I doing? Okay, so we got the avalanche started. Yeah. Yeah. How's the uh, exhaust smell on that one? Uh, no. Let me go stick my nose in my exhaust. <laughs> oh, smells potent. All right. <laughs> and uh, what's your RPMs at? Uh, it's all about 700. 700? Okay. All right, now pull up. Uh, let's do the same thing on the, as we did last time. Pull that image up that we sent the uh, text message over to. And we'll hold that one toward the uh, same thing. Hold it toward the gas tank for a couple of minutes. Okay. That's, uh, that's where you put it in. I'm holding it for the gas tank. <laughs> So if that phone was a lightsaber, it would be shooting a 30-foot light beam toward the gas tank on the vehicle. Well, mine's an old iPhone. That's okay. Whoops, wait a minute. I lost my picture there. Oh, there we go. Got the picture going now. Okay, well, right, we'll start the clock. So, um, yeah, how do you how how would you describe in so many not so many words what you just happened on the what just happened on the Nissan? So what just happened on the Nissan? He said it's running smooth. That's for sure. Yeah. Yeah, if this helps out my fuel mileage, I'll be happy as I'll get out. Oh, yeah. We see uh, across the board, everyone's this, this crazy reports we're getting back. Unheard of gains of 20 and 30, 40%. Right. Anomalies out there that are 50, 60% gains in fuel economy. Seconds taken off their quarter mile in zero to 60 times. I, it's just amazing. Okay, that, that truck should be good. Okay. All right, let's uh, rev it up now. Uh, put your screen back on. Rev, uh, rev this truck up to 2,000 RPMs for uh, a minute or so. Okay. How many miles does this truck have? 177,000. Got a little more. Got a little more than the Nissan, so we got probably, uh, uh, you know, a little more detox to do. But uh, it's still, nonetheless. No, he, no, he told. I'm, anyhow, what was that? I'm sorry. I'm saying still, uh, you know, still's got a lot of miles, but uh, still, still, our our main objective here is to take the pollution down. Yes. Yeah. All right. Well, let's rev it up to uh, 2,000. Okay, yeah, I got it up to 2,000. Okay. All right, on. How many miles are you getting on this truck? Right now, if I'm getting 14 a gallon, that's it. Wow. Yeah, you'll definitely yeah. notice an 18 or a 20, huh? It would, oh, I'd be so happy. Yep, yeah, yep. Yeah. 
All right, let's give this one a good punch or two. And what's our RPM settling down to? Six hundred. Yep. Wow. Maybe five fifty. There we go. It did drop. <laughs> All right. Remember that. Remember that terrible smell we had. Yeah. All right, Joanna. Oh, talk about terrible. You get high off that stuff. <laughs> <laughs> It'll knock you down. Yeah. No. You, you go in the ground. You won't. You won't get high. <laughs> Well, it's definitely different. It's steaming a lot now. Yeah, it's just starting to kick in. But that 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 pretty bad uh, odor, that bad exhaust smell, more like a dryer vent. Yeah. There you go. Exactly. Yeah. All right. Well, hey, that's what we do here at the Grayland Challenge. You know, just to um, let folks, you know, see the curiosity and go. Well, I don't know. This looks too good to be true. Um, regular folks out there, everybody across the world taking the challenge where we have so many videos on YouTube now where people go, wow, this thing must work. <laughs> so well, I see a difference. Definitely. Right. Right on. Well, we're going to send you out, um, two 10 packs. They're each uh, $2,500. It's 5,000 bucks worth of gear for taking this easy Grayland challenge. Um, Hey, until next time, this is thunder at grayland.com. Well, thank you very much. Thank you, Sandra. <laughs>